Hello children. Welcome back to my class. So children, we are on the same topic. Our topic name is sorting. Our topic name is sorting. So children, in our last class, we have drawn some pictures in our pencil time mathematics book. Isn't it? We have drawn some pictures in our pencil time mathematics book. So children, in this video, we are going to do some home fun activity. Okay? We are going to do some activity which you all have to do this activity at your home. So all of you, please take out your little thinker mathematics book. All of you, please take out your little thinker mathematics book. See children, this is the little thinker mathematics book which I have with me. So all of you, please take out your little thinker mathematics book and turn out the page number 15. Okay, you have to turn the page slowly. Okay, you have to turn the page slowly. So now... In page number 15, let us see what it has been written there and what we have to do. Okay, so now you all can see this page number 15, right? Mm -hmm. You all can see this page number 15. So, now let us see what it is written here. Okay, so let us see what it is written here. Okay, now see it is written here. Circle the containers that are empty. Circle the containers that are empty. So, we have to circle the containers which are empty. Okay. We have to circle the containers which are empty. Okay, children. So, now see in this first picture what it is drawn here. Can you all can see? Yes. It is jar, right? This is also a jar and this is also a jar. And in this jar, there is a fish. In this jar, there is a fish. But in the first jar, there is no fish, right? In this first jar, there is no fish. So that means this jar is empty and this jar is full. This jar is empty. This jar is full. So, what it is written here? Circle the containers that are empty. That means we have to circle the container which are empty, right? So, we have to circle this jar, not this one, okay? We have to circle this jar, but not this one, okay? So, you all have to wait. Let me circle this. So, we all have to circle this jar okay so now next picture what you all can see yes this is tell me this is glass right these are glasses right so in this first glass can you see there is what there is a straw in next glass what you can see is there is also a straw, but there is a juice in this glass, right? So, there is a juice in this glass, but there is no juice in this glass. So, what does it mean? This glass is empty and this glass is full. This glass is empty and this glass is full. So, what we have to circle? We have to circle the empty one right so you all have to circle this okay you all have to circle this first class okay children so now let us see what it is written here okay take the containers that are full what it is written here take the containers that are full we have to take the container which is full okay so now let us see what it is drawn here okay 
So now see in this first picture we can see there is a ice cream. Right. There is a ice cream. So in this first cup did you see any ice cream is there? Did you all can see any ice cream? No. But in this bowl, in this sorry, in this glass, we can see an ice cream, right? So that means this is empty and this is full. This is empty and this is full. So we have to take the full, right? We have to take the containers that are full. So we have to take this, right? So now come to the next. Now see, here we have the bowls, right? These are the bowls. And in this first bowl, there is something, right? Yes. But in the second bowl, you cannot see anything. So what does it mean? This bowl is full and this bowl is empty. This bowl is full. And this bowl is empty. So we have to take this full one. Right? So we have to take this bowl only. Okay? So children, I hope you all have understood in today's class. So please do this activity at your home and send it to me. So this is all for today. We will meet in our next class. Till then, bye-bye.